Shut the door, please, Elizabeth. You say, are you out of your senses? I thought you hated the man. No, Papa. He's rich, to be sure. He would have more fine carriages than Jane. But will that make you happy? Have you no other objection than your belief in my indifference? None at all. We all know him to be a proud, unpleasant sort of fellow. But this would be nothing if you really liked him. I do like him. Yeah. I love him. He's not proud. I was wrong. I was entirely wrong about him. You don't know him, Papa, if I told you what he was really like, what he's done. What has he done? Like him. I thought she didn't like him. So did I, so did we all. We must have been wrong. Won't be the first time, will it? No. <laughs> You're the last, I dare say. Good Lord. I must pay him back. No. You mustn't tell anyone. He wouldn't want it. We misjudged him, Papa, me more than anyone in... in every way, not just in this matter. I've been nonsensical. He's been a fool about... about Jane, about so many other things, but... but then so have I. You see, he and I are... He and I are so similar. <laughs> We've been so stubborn. <laughs> Papa, I... <laughs> you, you really do love him, don't you? Very much. <sighs> I cannot believe that anyone can deserve you. It seems I am overruled. So, I heartily give my consent. <gasps> I could not have parted with you, my Lizzie, to anyone less worthy. Young men come for Mary or Kitty, for heaven's sake, send them in. I'm quite at my leisure.